right, folks, here she is with much fanfare, the number one ranked strawweight contender. And there's no debate as to who is the number one contender in this division. She has earned this title shot, richly deserving. Now, of course, we see what she can do with it. Yes, she's earned it. I mean, she's taken the long route. Nothing's been given to her. And she said that she would not change anything. She wanted to make sure that she was prepared to not only get here, but become the champion of the world. She believes that her skills are ready. She believes that her mind's ready, body's ready. She's ready to go and feels that by the end of the night, she will be the world champion. Perhaps the biggest issue is just that the champion she is facing is otherworldly, has been on a serious run, one of the best pound for pound fighters in the sport. So try to defeat her here tonight. Folks, here we go, the UFC strawweight champion, and some would argue the best pound-for-pound pound women's mixed martial arts athlete in the world today. All of that being said, the magnitude of this challenge and this challenger is not lost on the incoming. No, it's not lost on her. She recognizes what's in front of her. She knows that this is going to be a tough fight. But she assured us that she has not left any stone unturned. She has trained hard. She has been thorough. She has been diligent. She has done everything to ensure that she keeps her belt at the end of the night. And she's not cocky, right? It's a confidence. There's an underlying humility. And it's a mental fortitude that, candidly, not a lot of fighters have. She's got it in spades. And we'll see if she can remain the hunted with a successful defense tonight. Tale of the tape for this strawweight championship fight. We send it inside the octagon. The veteran voice is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Angela Overkill Hill. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Randa Quietstar. Oh. Herb Dean, our Ready. referee for this one. Ready. All right, round one of this stand-up only fight is underway. A friendly reminder of the rules set. Not a whole lot of them, but you can't grapple or wrestle at all. And if the fight does hit the canvas, no follow-up strikes permitted on the ground. She slips that left hand there. Great volume on that combination. Oh, wow, how about the roundhouse kick? Tagged her with the overhand. How good a job does she do defensively to protect that head, raise the guard, a lot of good things in there. Yep, hands up, chin down. She's got a perfect position for defensive boxing. There's that body shot. Oh, strong kick to the body by her there. Oh, nice. That one landed, yep. Just over three minutes now to go. Man, she is just breaking her down with volume tonight as she lands another combination. I mean, over and over. Oh, oh she's got to keep pressing now. She missed with that jab. Yep. 
misses with the right hand. Well, her striking has... Oh! The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 30 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Angela Overkill Hill. So this is a belt that just continues to change hands. We have a new UFC strawweight champion. She is half your weight, and she is really good. I mean, she is as mean as anybody I've ever seen inside the octagon. Welcome to the club.